What's up, Power Maniacs? This is probably going to be a very quick video. Uh, we did get our Dwarven Crossbow set up in the last video. Uh, we got the schematic for it. And as you can see, it does 97 damage when upgraded to Superior, which is a little bit more than this one here. Unfortunately, we do lose the Armor Penetration. That's okay, because we're fixing to go into Ember Shard Mine. This is where the last uh, item is. You can see it's just southwest of Riverwood. This is one of the places that I, I start off doing every Let's Play. And down you go. Came out as a big furry kitty. Holy shit. Dude's got some back hair like a mofo, man. Damn. Alright, so this right here is one of the dungeons I cleared already. Uh, but for those of you who aren't aware, uh, dungeons do repopulate, traps reset, chests refill, and enemies come back. So um, I don't know what the timer is. I think it's like a month of in-game time. Just kind of goes to show how long we've been playing. His ass is down. Oh. Oh, dude, bicep shot. That's got to hurt. I don't think that's lethal. But damn, dude, if you had big old biceps like that, holy shit. Can you imagine taking an arrow in that thing? OMG, would that hurt? Damn. Fucking hurt. Alright, so our schematic is going to be in the loot chest, which is going to be right over here. Make sure there's nothing in here that needs acquiring real quick. Oh, come on. I'm going to try and do a nice little Batman maneuver here. There we go. That is my Batman trick for the day. For the day, to jump from there to there. I got my exercise. <laughs> All right, and I believe we have another little baddie right over there. I don't know if I can hit it from here. We'll try. What the fuck? I don't know. You should go in there and check it out, bro. Surprise! I don't know why these are all kitties all of a sudden. That's kind of interesting. Uh, usually, I don't think I've seen many bandit cats. And usually, you know, you'll have like one cat, maybe two. That's a second one in this place. That's a little odd. A roving band of murdering felines. Alright, well... Since we're here, we're going to go ahead and slide over here and put a couple arrows in these other bandits' face. I'm curious to see if they're also cats. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Is he a cat? That is definitely not a cat. Oh, going the distance? Oh, dude, that was a long shot. Holy shit. All right, can we can we time it? Oh, I missed. Missed that too. Yeah, I got him there. I'm not exactly the best moving shot sniper. Sorry about that, folks. Yep, already read that book more iron ore which we will happily transmute into silver and then gold and I do believe that is it for here we're gonna go ahead and hit this last chest that's up here on the left and that should conclude this and this basically also concludes the Dawn Guard storylines side quests we've gotten all of the different bow type or arrow types We've gotten all of the bows, and this will allow us to get the exceptional Dwarven Bow upgrade. Here we go. Oh, of course. Damn thing would be locked. There we go. Boom! Alright. Onward! And I think we've got one more bitch to loot that we tagged up here. Dude, look at that shot, man. That is a hell of a shot. Where did I hit her? Can you see the arrow? Or him? Where did I hit him? 
So I took that shot from right there. That's a pretty good shot. And I don't see my crossbow bolt. Oh, there it is. Right there. In his right thigh. The lethalness of the right thigh shot. Lol. Alright, let's go turn this... Um, let's go turn this uh, crossbow in and see how badass the new upgrade is. Now, the problem with this crossbow is, from what I understand, if I remember right, and I could be wrong, I'm sure one of the trolls will correct me if I am wrong, um, this right here simply gives you the armor penetration, which is nice, you know, because there's a lot of armored opponents in this game, and you get a heavy armored guy with a big badass shield of death and destruction, you really can't do much to him, so... This will allow me to take these guys out relatively easily. Um, she's over here. I want to make a mess! Oh, I got cock blocked by that. I'm just going to jump up on the table and just run through and knock all this shit off. Hope you're getting along with these just be a general ass. Some used oh, to. come on. There we go. I can certainly try. Oh, damn it! Wrong button. You never disappoint. Now this is a fine. Here, let me show you how it's made. All right, so she teaches you that if you've got the smithing skills, you can construct it. I don't have the smithing the smithing skills. Now, as you'll see right here, the damage on these 86 and 86, which is this one ignores 50% of the armor. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy that bad boy. Good day. And then we're gonna go ahead and upgrade her here. Enhanced Dwarven Crossbow, 86, 97. Now it's 97 and 97. So basically it's the same bow, just with a 50%. Sad face. I think I'm going to go ahead and upgrade all the rest of these just for the skill. Anyways, that pretty much concludes this video. I know it was a short one, but... Uh, can't really help it if they make the, the little quest short. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, please click that like button. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my other videos, tips, tricks, and guides. And I'll catch you guys in the next clip.